with Election Day fast approaching, there's a shortage of poll workers in many parts of this country. They serve as greeters at polling sites, they manage lines, and hand out ballots. Well, in tonight's Weekend Journal, CBS's Nick Calloway shows us how a county in New Jersey is turning to young people for help. Matthew Izaguerre drops his ballot in the ballot box. The I voted sticker is real, but the ballot was just for training. He's too young to vote. It's a cool thing to do, that this opportunity that we have. Izaguerre is one of about 30 seniors at this New Jersey high school who are learning to be election workers. State law now allows 16 and 17 year olds to work polling places. The Bergen County Board of Elections is working with 20 high schools this election cycle to recruit and train about 350 students. We want to make it clean. Chairman Richard Miller says it started as a pilot program last year. It was very successful. We had great response from the voters, from the people that worked with the students. And so we expanded it. Just don't wear anything that says Trump or Harris. Are we clear on that? Wes Wagner trains election workers on the equipment so, and the rules. This group is younger than he's used to. Poll workers tend to be retirees. They tend to be a little older and less familiar with some of the new technology that's out there. And that's what makes these high school kids so valuable. This is like in our blood and we know how to use tech so much because it's everything we've known since we've been born. Those students will get paid $160 for working eight hours on election day, plus $50 for the training. But they tell me it's not about the money. Yeah, because I want to feel involved with um, my town and our state even. And since it's not, I can't vote yet, this makes me feel like I'm a part of it. Too young to vote, yes, but never too young to get involved. Nick Calloway, CBS News, Woodridge, New Jersey.